side of the court as we look down. And the former world number ones matches going to three games. Total time on court, four hours and 30 minutes. Total time on court. The Koreans are very fit. I don't think it'll be affecting them for today's final, will it? No, I don't think either. I don't think either. Three game matches, they've lost the first game and then come back to win it. I'm not sure about the two first, but I checked yesterday in the semi-final. And I called it myself, but I have to check to be sure that they started yesterday on this near side of the court against Matsuyama and, uh, and Shida. I just felt that, um, and I said it yesterday, that perhaps this was a little bit of an odd um, combination because I felt they had different playing styles, but they kind of is adventurous and more attacking, so I thought they might have a clash of styles, but that wasn't the case at all. That's one long into back nine. That's over. That came off the frame. Indecision there from Shai Yifan. Of course, the loss of point. Indecision. That's pushed long as well. Six, five. Oh! Over. Get when you make a new combination. We, we saw it in, in mixed doubles just uh, previous to this match here. You get a little bit extra fight. You, get, you, you go that little extra distance for you. Or uh, is it um, just a one-off for this uh, European trip that um, they've mixed it to uh, give new inspiration to the normal combinations? Yeah. That combinations, and it was no, uh, no uh, prize for having the average best performance by four women's doubles. You need to find the two very best that can come doubles from China. So it makes sense to, to test it once in a while. Yeah. Good point. That's a lovely return of serve. Forces a short lift and she's hit long. Would you believe it? Should have made more of that. They can't now. So it's a two-point advantage. So the two-point advantage just when it resumes in this opening game. Oh. Just long. That's a pity. Yeah, I think they're the favourites. And one of the one of the problems here, in terms of what, um, what I mentioned earlier, that uh, yesterday they chose this near side of the court to play from the Koreans, and if the opponents have changed, then it could be a different complexion. Fourteen. Yeah. Eleven. And if they continue to play a more patient game, then they would uh, target the uh, chin a bit more. With that big smash in here. So they might need help from the drift in the other way so that when Jay Fun is giving her smashes up against the drift, they might be able to defend her. Well, this is a purple patch by the world champ. Oh, 
Watch the game wide. Hey. Oh, the run comes. Game. Opening game, 21 12. trying to become the fourth different Korean women's doubles pair to win in eight years here at Denmark. Partnerships because they seem used to playing this particular style for them. Yeah. That's over. Yeah, that's a great interception. Great third shot. Remember, there was only four different nations. Yeah. One for women's doubles time. That's another terrific flick serve. Uh, okay, can remember one PT. Cradle like you didn't have a second approach at that time. Mr. Pedersen. Rally the match so far. Oh, she's missed it. Please, so he going for the acute angle. And she missed it. Oh. Yeah. So yeah, she took that early. That was wrong. Yeah. It's also difficult against uh, Jay Fan. Attacking, but mostly Lee So He making her way. Uh, just, uh, I'm, right now, I'm very impressed with the Chinese pair because I feel that they are. There's a reason for being a three time world champion. They're overall very solid in all that they have a, a good beat. Me. There's, there's no big weaknesses in their game. Here, they've been totally dominant. Just need to 
think she was a post blue cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. It's deep smack. Three easy points and brought them within striking distance. Oh, so running the match, hasn't it? Yeah. It's gone long at the back line. And match point opportunities. A stitch. Six over. Forty. Match point. Opportunity. 21, 12, 21.